All right, what's up everybody out there? Thank you so much for joining me today. This is Dan Muscarella. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create your very own vision board using Google Slides. And with Google Slides, one of the things that you wanna do, and the reason we're gonna use Google Slides because it's quick, it's easy, it's accessible, and we're gonna bring in pictures from all over the place that have meaning for us. So we wanna get our page set up correctly. And I'm gonna, so what you do is you go over to File, you go all the way down to Page Setup on the left side of your Google Slides, and then you're gonna choose Custom. And I'm gonna choose an eight by 10 inch frame, and I'm going to explain why. Here's why. I wanna print this out. So I'm gonna take it to Costco, Kinko's, wherever you wanna to do to print this out, and you could put it in an eight by 10 frame. You can make it a photo, because you can download this image as a JPEG, as a PDF, as all sorts of things. And then that way you can even use it as a screensaver on your phone or on your computer. So if you wanted to go on your computer, maybe instead of an eight by 10, you do 10 by eight, however you wanna do it. So that'll be something that you'll play with as you go throughout this. But for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna use an eight by 10 and that's the dimensions that you see here represented in this. So get your page set up however you want. And then when you're ready to roll, let's go. First thing you may wanna do is find a cool background, right? So this was something that resonated with me is a sunset. So I love sunsets. It's got a very personal meaning for me in my life. So I wanted that kind of as a background to then put other pictures on top of. So you can choose to have a virtual background or not. It's totally your call. Now, some of the other things that you wanna do is you wanna find pictures and some of these pictures will be of you and some of them will be of things that you wanna do and places you wanna go and all those types of things. So like here in this picture, there's a picture of my brother Joe and I. And we're just goofing off, having a good time down here at Ironman Augusta years ago. And this is a reminder to me to not take life so seriously, to always try and bring joy and laughter in all the moments of the day that I can. And that's, so that's why I had that in there. That picture's gonna go on my vision board. So again, find pictures that resonate with you. Maybe there's quotes that resonate with you, right? So here's one quote that re resonated with me. And so that's gonna go on my vision board. Anything that represents the quality of the life that you wanna live, not just now, but in the future. So find pictures, find quotes, find images that fill you up, that bring you joy and set your soul on fire and remember that help to remind you to keep living the life that you want, the life that you're destined to have. Here's a picture of me skydiving, right? I was so scared to do that, but still, I stepped out of my comfort zone, I did that. What an incredible memory. And I'm gonna do it again, I can't wait to do it again. But this picture reminds me to step out of my comfort zone and do some things and maybe walk to the edges of the earth. And, that, and just remember, when you're creating your vision board, you wanna pick things that are gonna help you represent the life that you wanna live. So these are gonna be things maybe you haven't done yet. All right, so what kinds of things might they be? Well, think about the types of relationships that you wanna have in your life. Do you wanna be married? Do you wanna have children? These are the, and what's the quality of those relationships? How, how wonderful and exciting and lovely are they going to be? So I want you to visualize that. So find a picture of a happy family of, of solid friendships and put that on your vision board. Where are you gonna travel, Where, work and live? Like, are there places you wanna go to and see? There's seven wonders of the world. Do you wanna go visit the pyramids in Egypt? Cool, put a picture of that on your board. Do you wanna go see Niagara Falls? Awesome! If you do, pro tip, stay on the Niagara side, uh, or the Canadian side, because the views are much cooler there. But definitely find places that you wanna travel and work and live. And when you're working, can you actually work one place but live somewhere else in this digital world, perhaps you're gonna be able to telecommute. So you can live somewhere maybe super inexpensive, but make the big bucks, right? To buy the cars and the houses and the things that may also fill you up and bring your joy in your life. And not only that, where you work and live and travel, the types of relationship, thinks about the things that mean a lot to you, the charities and the causes that you want to support throughout your life. Maybe there's something that resonates with you because uh, maybe, for example, you know somebody with cancer. It's, a, it's impacted so many people's life or suicide or horse slaughter, whatever. Find something that matters to you and donate your time, donate your money to these types of organizations. So 
when you put all of those things together, you're going to end up with something that may look like this. This is a work in progress. I've been working at this for several months and it's not done yet. There's still some other pictures I got to put on here, but this is a really good start of some quotes and some pictures and some places that I want to go and visit and reminders of how I'd like to live my life. So no matter what, find things that resonate with you about the type and the quality of life that you want to live, not just today, but every day for your future. Because you know what? We're all born. We have that beginning date. Maybe it was 1970. Maybe it was 1980. Maybe it was 2000. Whatever the year is that you started your life, there's a dash. Now, we don't know the ending date, but whatever that is, live your best life. Live your dash. All right, so hopefully that gives you some ideas and some things to put into your vision board. And I look forward to seeing some of yours out there. And I wish you the best in all that you do. Peace.